you're looking for a new controller that won't cost a fortune. First up is the PDP Afterglow wired controller for Xbox Series X and S. Coming in at £25, which looks cool with its LED glow through its clear plastic body, which can be changed with four customizable LED lighting modes, which is sweet as you can see everything working inside, which is a nice touch. The downside of this see through design is it's quite slippery, and if you get sweaty palms during a tense gaming session, this controller might not be ideal for you. This works with the PDP app and has built in audio controls for you to control your headset via the 3.5mm headphone jack. I think this could be a cool backup controller or one for you RGB lovers out there. But don't worry, there will be another RGB controller on this list just so you have some options. Next up is the Turtle Beach Recon controller which comes in white or black colours for you to match your Series X or Series S. The Turtle Beach Recon controller is excellent value and ideal for anyone that wants some helpful extra features on their gamepad without spending silly money. The enhanced audio is great if you can connect a wired headset as this can improve the sound quality of cheaper gaming headsets. The Recon lets you adjust the game audio and the chat volume independently with two volume rockers, one at each side. Turtle Beach even put in a superhuman hearing button, which is a signature feature from its gaming headset lineup that emphasises easy to miss sounds like footsteps, doors opening and other key sounds that might give you an edge over your opponents. But it's also the inclusion of precision aiming, remappable buttons, two back buttons on the rear and an excellent grip all over the controller that really makes this gamepad stand out for only £50. Again, a downside is it is a wired controller but it has a 3 meter cable so you should be cool unless you sit a long way from your console. And if I'm being honest, it's probably not the slickest looking controller around, but the feature list more than it makes up for that. Now time for a trip down memory lane with the Hypercon Duke wired controller. This comes in black, white, green and my favourite, the purple Cortana version. Apart from its looks, this controller does everything your standard Xbox controller does with no other standout features apart from a very cool Cortana montage played right inside the Xbox button on the front of the controller. This for me is just so cool looking and if you had an original Xbox, this might be right up your street, especially if you're playing loads of original Xbox games on Xbox Game Pass. For £70 with this controller you get the special Halo 20th Anniversary Cortana Edition. These are limited editions so grab them while you can. Precise analog triggers, a 3.5mm headphone jack, vibration feedback and a detachable Type-C cable. If you are looking for an affordable, customizable and comfortable controller, the 8-Bit Do Pro 2 wired controller for Xbox is great for gamers who love a stick layout that is more similar to a PlayStation controller or those playing 2D retro games who will appreciate the position of the D-pad on this controller. The Pro 2 certainly looks very sleek with the signature Xbox home button and every other input found on modern Xbox controllers including the new share button packed into this minimalist looking controller. Where it differs is on the back panel. The Pro 2 has a pair of remappable back buttons, which I love, and the rest of the inputs can be customised as well using the included app for iOS or Android. The customization software also lets you tweak vibration settings, stick tension and trigger pull sensitivity for a truly custom gaming experience. The 8-Bit Do Pro 2 wired controller for Xbox is available now and costs just $45 US or £40 in the UK. It's an absolute bargain. I use the next controller pretty much every day, the Spectra Infinity Enhanced Wired Controller from Power A for Xbox Series X and S. 
This really unique looking gamepad offers a ton of customizable colour combinations across the three distinct LED light zones, which is a big win if you love RGB like I do. There's also the new share button on the front to easily capture your gaming wins or fails, a 3.5mm headphone jack with volume dial and microphone mute button which is super handy to be able to control right at your fingertips. There is three way trigger locks to set the level you need to press in the trigger button to fire off a shot which means you can get an edge on your opponent and precision tuned thumbsticks complete this brilliant gamepad which only costs £40 in the UK or $45 in the United States. And if you want most of these features in a controller minus the RGB lights, you can get this controller in 15 different colours minus the RGB for only £35 or $40. US dollars. If you pick up one of these controllers, make sure you find out what other essential Xbox accessories you need by clicking the card on screen right now.